salon here in the Philippines and also a nail salon they also do gel nails but I mainly went for lash extension so this is like prior I have no other experiences with eyelash extension salons so if you have recommendations on when I where I should get my other eyelash extensions or my favorite guy or if you've tried new lounge before and you've tried another one and you recommend that more then please comment down below because I would definitely want to explore that so yeah um, I got the eyelash extensions for my birthday I got them done I think May 29 May 29 or May 31 and um, I just got rid of them siguro last week of July So I've always wanted to get eyelash extensions, siguro ever since yung mink pa lang siya, yung medyo hard pa siya. And I've always wanted to try it kasi so, sobrang low maintenance ko kasi I'm so lazy with maintaining like beauty stuff. I do love makeup, I love getting dressed up, pero yung mga ganito, wala akong tiyaga. But then I actually, you know who convinced me? Yung niece ko, yung niece ko kasi she got it for her debut. So yeah, so it's like, oh, I want to try that and then I also want to get nice beach photos and stuff like that since i am going to barakay for one week for my birthday and also anniversary namin said so i bit the bullet and just went for it but anyways this is how the lashes look like so barang ganda niya and sobrang light na guys as in walang kabigat bigat you won't feel anything you won't feel like you have lashes on so i got mine done from new lounge Pumunta ko sa Glorietta branch nila. So, this one is Cat Eye Prominent Set. So, my natural is my prominent. Since I actually have pretty long eyelashes, they're, they're long pero nakababa siya. Though they are thicker than the typical lashes. So, if nag-natural lang ako, feeling ko ma-achieve ko lang yun with my mascara. So, I went for prominent, I went for cat eye. This is 9, 10, 11. So, yun. So yeah, so I spent 3,500 for this one. So medyo masakit siya sa bulsa. But la la, gift ko na rin para sa sarili ko. So yun. my lashes they are longer than the usual they are a bit thicker pero nakababa siya so um, medyo hirap ako pum uh, pumili ng mascara because it really has to hold my curl and I cannot go without curling my lashes which you know they are not very good for your lashes but wala kasi maging useless lang talaga siya so my experience with new lounge I love my lashes okay as in I'm just giving my eyes a break but I fell in love with eyelash extensions ang ganda na pagkagawa the lashes are very very soft they're, they're fluttery and they're very very light as in like I felt like I had nothing on my eyes mas mabigat pa yung ibang mascaras it's super super lightweight and honestly uh, the reason why I was 
like I held off from getting eyelash extensions extensions was because I'm very low maintenance. I don't like maintaining anything na makaka, I don't know, like I have to be gentle, <laughs> you know, washing my face, which you should be, but dito mas extra gentle ka. Or what if you're swimming ako, gusto ko maglap. Paano yun, you know? I, I just, I have no patience for that. So, yeah, that's why I stopped dyeing my hair. Wala talaga akong patience. <laughs> so, uh, I just, I'm very low maintenance. But I really loved it. I fell in love with it. And honestly, kahit medyo may konting discomfort lang sometimes, I would get them again. Um, super napadali yung makeup process ko. As in, so, yeah. Um, I did go to Boracay twice when I had my eyelash extensions. And of course, if you're gonna swim, nakakalangoy naman ako, but you would need goggles para lang to make sure na talagang okay yung lashes mo. Like, you're not really gonna damage your lashes. Pero sobrang, sobrang higpit ng glue nila, guys. And I did go scuba diving as well with my eyelash extensions, and they were fine. Um, in terms of um, yung pag fallout niya, um, may mga nahuhulog na na lashes, I think the um, second week or after week one pero super like wala hindi nyo masyadong mapapansin na may difference and I think that's normal and I was swimming guys um, so yun medyo may may, may nahukulog ng lashes and of course I think some people would think na na, na ano yun nababawasan yung lashes nila kasi may nahukulog na lashes honestly guys yung cycle ng lashes natin talagang may mahuhulog at maghuhulog talaga na lashes. Kasi syempre, and you know, it, it, napapalitan siya. It's like with skin. You know, turn over, ganyan. <laughs> so, I had no problems with them when I was in the beach. Um, of course, I actually struggle with dry eyes. So, if you have dry eyes, hindi recommended ng eyelash extensions. Doon lang siya medyo nagiging heavy for me. Um, because it's my personal fault na. So, hindi, hindi dahil sa eyelash extensions yon. But if you do have dry eyes, Ano, medyo tiis ganda lang talaga siya. But honestly, even if I do eye drops all the time, hindi siya, wala nangyayari sa lashes ko. It stays put. The only thing, the other thing that I noticed, since, um, pababa nga talaga yung lashes ko, even with eyelash extensions, properly done, nahihirapan sila ate, paangatin yung lashes ko, lalo dito sa inner part. So sometimes, I think I woke up twice na I had like eyelash extension literally sa loob na ng mata ko. Because I think, because my 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 um, eyelashes just just wouldn't stay up. So, yun, napansin ko lang. Twice na nangyari yun, na nakaganon siya. And, um, I'm not really, I'm, hindi naman ako malikot, matulog, pero may mga times na, I guess I'm a lot more tired, so I move more, um, so I sleep on my side. And there's only a few times that I woke up that I have eyelashes on the pillowcase or, um, sa bed mismo. Um, yeah, so it went well. I think for the whole month hanggang gitna ng July, um, okay naman yung lashes ko. Um, at, Siyempre, nababawasan, nababawasan siya, pero ano pa rin siya, um, acceptable pa rin siya. But, um, since I'm going back to Boracay then on July, middle of July, I went there in June, went back on July, um, pansin ko, ang unang nabawasan talaga is actually, I think, my right eye. I don't know what it is. Mas, mas, mas madaling nahulog yung mga eyelash extensions dito compared sa left eye, which I'm not really sure why. Oh, bad. Bad I wasn't really sure why, so medyo nabungi siya sa gitna. Okay lang sa akin kung medyo nabubungi ng konti sa, sa labas or yung konti dito sa loob. Pero pag medyo sa, sa gitna na nabungi, medyo don medyo weird yung itsura niya. So I did, went, I, I went back to have them repaired. Um, they have three levels na pag-repair. Merong retouch, repair, and petite. Retouch basically is something that they recommend actually going back to the salon after two weeks to see if may kailangan tanggalin, ganyan. Ang repair, I mean, ang retouch, they just take out yung mga eyelash, eyelashes na medyo sansan uh, na napagpad or medyo weird na yung itsura. They're just gonna take out the bad eyelashes. Yung 
hindi na medyo hanging by the thread na lang siya or um, nakapatong na lang siya. They remove that but they don't add new eyelashes. Um, with the repair, which is the one that I got, and you guys could see my lashes beforehand, hindi na sila sobrang fluffy. Medyo bungi-bungi na talaga siya. So, I don't think I could have just gone for repair. So, I went I for retouch. So, nagpa-repair na ako. Ang repair, they, re, they take out the, the bad lashes and replace them with, I think, 30 pieces ng eyelashes. So, mine, I didn't expect mine to look super, super nice. But, na-amaze na ako kasi like afterwards, I didn't expect much, to be honest. I just I just really wanted na ma-fill in yung gap sa may bunga. Just so it looks nice pagbalik sa Boracay. But, I, I liked it. It's like, it's not as fluttery and fluffy as the first time. Pero, I loved it. Ang ganda rin ng itsura niya. It's like, dull eyes the first time, but a little bit more natural, which I actually do like. So, yeah, the repair was 900 pesos. So, hmm, <laughs> medyo mahal siya. And then you have the petite. The petite, I think, is 1,000 or 1,600. Lalo kinang I think it's 1,500 or 1,600. The petite is basically giving you new set of lashes. I think they put in 60 pairs of lashes. So, yun. So, I did go for repair. Though, after Boracay, I did stay as long. Yung first time ko nag Boracay, I stayed there for one week. This one is mainly four days and three nights. So, yeah. Um, napansin ko lang, since I guess it's repair, and syempre, there's previous lashes na, so hindi siya yung sobrang bago. Mas mabilis naglagas yung mga eyelashes ko the second time. I um, mean, you can actually go to new lounge to get your eyelash accessions removed for free. I was planning on doing that, but I never really had time. So, hinintay ko na lang siyang mahulog isa-isa. <laughs> so, nung medyo dalawa na lang ata dito, tapos isa na lang dito, I decided to actually use eyelash curler na. Kasi, kailangan ko na talaga ng something, something sa aking mata. And honestly, yung dalawa dito, nahulog siya after eyelash um, curler. Pero yung isa dito, as in, nakailang eyelash curler na ako, after ilang days pa siya na nahulog. So, sobrang kapit na kapit talaga yung glue nila. So, you don't have to worry about it falling out. So, yun na napansin ko. I guess, syempre, you know, it's the new, the additional lashes were sticking onto the lashes and that's been there for quite some time. So, of course, hindi ganun siya magsistick. And honestly, I wasn't really the best in terms of taking care of my lashes. I didn't even wash them. I just, I just, after taking a bath, I comb them. I suggest you comb them because when you take a bath, syempre dumidikit siya. And I immediately brush it para hindi siya magdikit-dikit. So, brush it while it's actually still wet. At first, I didn't do that, but when I realized na mas maganda yung, yung pag-spread out niya while it's still wet, I started doing it. But honestly, I wish I took better care of them. Siguro pas, baka mas nag pa siya, but that just shows na sobrang ganda ng quality ng new lounge eyelashes, even if hindi ka sobrang meticulous in terms of taking care of them. So I think the next time I um, uh, go there, I might, I might try the doll eyes. Um, and actually use eyelash shampoo <laughs> and care for them better but highly highly recommend the new lounge um, eyelash extensions I think they're really really nice though they are pricey um, the one that I got is the prominent set so it's 3,500 but it lasted me a long time and I'm definitely getting one again this Christmas so yeah hope you guys like my review for the new lounge BH um, extensions and yeah please don't forget to click the subscribe button down below don't forget to give this video a thumbs up and I'll see you guys in my next video Bye.